hello everyone welcome to the channel in this video i am going to show you a mind-blowing model called as oasis oasis is an interactive world model developed by descartes and etched it is based on diffusion transformers oasis takes in user keyboard input and generates gameplay in an auto regressive manner you don't need any game engine you don't need any logic you don't need any code it is all on the basis of this 500 million parameter model which you can install locally on your system and then generate a gameplay again without any game engine and that is what we are going to do in this video locally privately all for free i will also be sharing the link to this model in video description so that you can also play around you can even check out this demo from their website so let me click on start here and just look at this so it is just telling you that this is a model which has been trained on gameplay hours of millions and millions of different frames so if i click on next here so for instance i'll just take you to this village outpost so this is just a map and i'm just beginning my journey and then you can play with it you see you can move and this is all with the keyboard input and this for example you can go with w a and you can see at the bottom there are few controls and similarly you can play any um, other role play which you like how good is that and this you can generate all local and this is not a real gameplay by the way and now let's try to get this installed on our local system and then we will see how it works before i do that let me introduce you to the sponsors of video who are agent ql agent ql is a query language which turns any web page into a data source it is quite resilient it is quite performant and it works with any web page also it uses natural language to pinpoint the information you are looking for and it can be reused across multiple similar pages and i will drop the link to it in video's description okay so let me take you to my local system where i am running ubuntu 22.04 let me quickly show you so this is my ubuntu system and i have one gpu card nvidia rtx a6000 with 48 gpu of vram and i will also show you the gpu consumption once we get it installed and running the model i mean so first up let's create a virtual environment with conda i'm just calling it ai let's wait for it to finish installing and then it installs a lot of things as a prerequisites which include torch torch vision transformers so i'm just running it as is and I will drop the link to its repo where you can find these commands easily and this is going to take four to five minutes so let's wait all the prerequisites are done and now let's git clone the repo and as as i said i am going to drop the link to it in video's description let's install all the requirements from the root of repo i believe we already have installed a lot of stuff already so it shouldn't take too long and that's all done let's clear the screen and now we need to log into hugging face because it's a get it model so you would have to go to hugging face accept the terms and conditions for this model and then you should be able to get a read token for free from hugging face from your profile so i'm just inputting my token from hugging face and now my login is successful as you can see here at the bottom next up we need to download the models and there are two models one is diffusion transformer which is the actual model we need to download by just using this hugging face cli and you see that it is being downloaded the size is very small like 2.43 for a diffusion transformer model so let's wait for it to get downloaded and it's in the pytorch format let's wait for it and if you don't know what this diffusion transformer is diffusion transformer model combines 
two techniques diffusion model and transformer models diffusion models learn to gradually refine and generate images or data by reversing a noisy process whereas transformer models use attention mechanism to focus on relevant information and understand relationships that's what they do okay so the model is downloaded next up we also need to download this model which is a wet model or uh, which also uses a variational autoencoder which converts images from latent space to pixel space these are normally smallish model as you can see so let's wait for it and the models have been downloaded here as you can see now before i proceed further i will show you something from their code which we are going to use to generate the gameplay so i'm just opening it in my vs code so this is the open oasis repo if you click on generate file you will see this contains all the code to generate the gameplay it imports some of the libraries then it loads the model which we have just loaded and you can see that it is just using it from the current working directory and then there are some sampling parameters and this is where you can give your input a video so you see if i go to sample data here they already have provided some of the videos but you can simply replace your own video with it for example you want to create a gameplay something like minecraft or uh, maybe any other game which you like and then you just need to provide a sample video here and then that's about it it is going to generate a gameplay out of it so that is what it is doing so let me go back to the terminal and then from here i'm just going to run this command which is generate dot by so it has loaded both the models you can ignore these warnings for now and now it is performing the actions here and you can see that it is showing you the eta of under six minutes and this is the time to check our gpu consumption as how much gpu it is taking so let me quickly show you in real time so it is check taking just under 6 gig of vram that's it so you if you have a 8 gb vram gpu card feel free to use it okay so let's wait for it to finish and while that happens let me also introduce you to our sponsors of the vm and gpu who are masked compute if you are looking to rent a gpu on affordable prices i will drop the link to their website in video's description Plus, I'm also going to give you a coupon code of 50% discount on range of GPUs, so do check them out. Okay, so let's go back and wait. Okay, so it has generated something and it says that generation save to video.mp4. Let's check it out. So I'm just going to clear it. I'm just going to do a list LTR and it has just created this video.mp4. So let me go to this open OSS directory in the home. I believe it should be here somewhere. There you go. And we have this video.mp4. Do I have any player? Yes, I do. So let me play it. Let's wait for it to get launched in that player. There you go. So this is not a real gameplay this is just a minecraft which it has just generated from a sample video that's about it and if i quickly show you the original video the input video so this snippy chart reuse massive something like this this was the video and this is already present there let me open that snippy one so this is a snippy video let me play it so this is just a sample video as you can see and now on the basis of it what it has done is it has just created this video.mp4 no gameplay no game engine no code nothing all just through the model where we have provided it an input video and it has generated a gameplay out of it how good is that and with just 6 gb of vram and similarly i just gave it another sample video and generated a new one let me play it for you this is another gameplay look at this it is simply outstanding real good stuff so that's it guys i hope that you enjoyed it let me know what do you think about this model 
maybe you can create your own gameplay even without playing anything upload it on youtube because i've seen that when people play minecraft and then upload the gameplay there are millions and millions of views on those videos so who knows anyway if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel if you're already subscribed please share it among your network as it helps a lot thank you for watching